guys, what's up? It's Hijevin. How is everybody doing? I'm back with another episode of Let's Play Minecraft. I hope you guys are having a great day so far. I know I'm doing awesome. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get started. All right, guys, so today's episode, we start off up... Whoa, that was weird. You guys see that? In the corner? That's <laughs> so weird. Uh, anyways, guys, we're starting off up here on the deck today. Uh, we're going to be working on the house some more. Um, you guys destroyed last challenge man on the blockville ftv video i asked for 1333 likes and right now it's sitting at 2200 all right i see i see so i'm gonna have to actually give you guys some sort of real challenge because you're just annihilating anything i throw at you uh also guys um i haven't checked the world size yet actually i'm just gonna do it right now i'm doing it live uh, I just want to see what the size of our world is, because if it is under 200 megabytes, I will put it up for download for you guys. Uh, folder, properties, we're at 109 megabytes. Alright, since you guys have been so awesome at doing these challenges, you guys get a world download. So I will put this world download up for you guys uh, in the description of the video. So, uh, you guys have utterly just destroyed each challenge I've given you, so I gotta give you something hard today. Um, so I think today's Jevenator challenge, um, is going to be 1,777 likes. That's 400 more than yesterday. Now, 2,200 was overnight, but you guys, I think you guys, I don't know, it's gonna be close. I, I think you guys will get it. We'll see, we'll see. So I wanted to give you something harder. 1,777 likes, and as always, 500 comments. And if you get more, hey, no big deal. So, uh, today, what are we doing today? Well, we need to make a project board, because we don't have one in this world, so that's going to be part of the project board. Um, let me get some food here. Alright, so I want to put the project board right here. Um, and I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to tear this back a bit, and... Um, so I want to have I want to have pieces of wood here. Uh, actually, not exactly right there. Um, hmm. See, this is this is what. Let me go to these. I didn't notice that. This is what's bugging me. Maybe we should tear it back one more and go right there. But then again, that doesn't really work too well for this right here. Then. But then again, it's all going to be covered, too. So uh, what we could do is we could do this, and we could do... Uh, oh, I didn't realize it was out of line. Is it out of line? It is. Needs to be back even further. Okay. Well, we can always just put a row in right here. That's not a big deal. And then we can put another one in, and it'll be in line. Uh, we can put wood planks down there. Let me get some wood planks. And so this is where our permanent, uh, for, see, the, the game plan here is to have a project board in each one of the areas of our world that we work in. So we'll have one at the village and everything. Uh, that'll be perfect right there, I think. So we'll have pieces of wood going up there and pieces of wood going up here. This will signify, signify, this is signify the entrance to our house as well. Something like that. And then we'll... Okay, so what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to dig this out and kind of shape it a bit. And I'll be back in a minute. All right, guys. So I have shaped the area. And I think it actually looks pretty good here. Um, so I made it so it was even on both sides. And then we're going to run the wood up completely. Uh, so this one needs to go up and this one needs to go up. So let's, first off, let's go here. Because we want to continue the theme. Uh, how am I going to do this? So I could do it like that. I don't really have a way to get up there, though. Scaffolding! Always remember your dirt, guys. Always. Uh, there we go. And let's get rid of you. And you. Oh, I should have done on top of there, too. Let's make some steps here. Okay. Good thing I brought my bed. It's almost nighttime. Uh, okay. And then on the bottom as well. Gotta continue our theme, guys. Come on now, man. And let's go ahead and lay our next area down. And more of this. So this is going to be where the project board is going to sit. Um, hmm. How do I propose to get over there? Should be fine just like that. And there we go. Awesome. Okay, let's break that. 
Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, let's get rid of you. And let's sleep too. Oh, I can't sleep yet, really? Okay. Come on now. Okay, let's get rid of this while we wait then. No point in wasting time. <laughs> what the heck? I hate that we're up in like the mountains, kind of. Because you can't really see... Okay, it's had to have broke the horizon by now. The hell, that was weird. Okay, so. We have our area uh, put out of here. Now, let's see. I've got leaves. I think I'll cover it in leaves just so we can... very high it's like it's really hard to actually like place these blocks and reach them there we go perfect okay now let's go ahead and we need some fences here let's go do this don't want to break all of this down just a little bit of it maybe a stack Hopefully that'll be enough fences. That's 33. Uh, it should be good. Here, let's put some dirt back there. I'm going to keep the natural terrain back there. I think it looks kind of cool, to be honest with you. Uh, we do need to find some cool ways to put lighting in, though. There we go. Awesome. Now, the one last thing that we have to finish is um, this right here. you Ooh. I forgot that I put slabs there how cheap of me <laughs> okay so now this is where we'll have two different walls for the project board uh, I was actually thinking about moving the map over here and putting the project board here um, that might be a good idea. All right, guys, so I moved the map, and I put it back here, and then I inset it. And I think it looks a ton better inset like this. Remember, this is just a small map of our little part of our world here. We've got the uh, the castle and our area right here that we've been working on. It's very dark underneath of this guy. So uh, I'm just going to throw some torches down for now, and uh, later on we'll figure out lighting. Um, so next up, let's go ahead and finally get to the signs uh looks like i'm out of wood though uh noob jevin mistake but uh so yeah i um i want to do these signs throughout our world uh i should probably actually check and see if we have any signs that would probably be better but i'm just gonna be like yellow no. i don't even care bro no <laughs> uh oh there's a sheepy okay but uh yeah i want to do um one billboard or one sign board project board at each place like I had mentioned before uh, and then kind of try to blend that in with the area so I think at the village it's gonna be pretty easy uh, here's pretty easy not sure if I want to continue on I've lost pretty much all motivation to work over at the mining area mining outpost I think the castle kind of killed it for me I think I want to make it back to a mining post I was trying to maybe overdo myself a little bit uh, okay let's make some signs here turn this into planks there we go awesome so uh what i think we're gonna do is i think we're just going to fill all of these up empty like uh like this and then i wish there was an edible signs like if they added anything that's what i would want i think there we go so now at the top where are we gonna put um actually you know what i think i'll fill in the top part as well and then whenever we need to do something let's just get our axe so, first part of the today was to make uh, make gold board. Uh, and move map. So, we have that finished. That's good. Now, um, the next thing I want to do is um, rename cow and moves to 
beef area. Uh, that looks off. Something here looks too... There we go. Awesome. And uh, last but not least, let's uh, take this. I want to mess around uh, ideas for design inside beef machine. There we go. So we have the first thing done. So let's go ahead and head over to the beef machine. Um, so for this part of the video, I actually have a cool idea. I think we're going to go back to the minecart system because hanging the mobs there is just not going to work. I have tried and tried and tried again uh, with no luck whatsoever. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to take some minecarts and um, do we have any stone brick here? I'll probably actually take stained clay. I like stained clay more. Um, now there's a minecart. Let's take that one. I thought I had two minecarts. Maybe I don't. They're probably here, and I've probably passed them eighty-seven thousand times. I really gotta. I can't wait to get organized with our deep storage. It's gonna be sick. So we have those two, and I don't see anything there, and I don't see anything there. I'll just make another minecart. It's perfectly okay. I don't really care too much. Uh, there we go. We're also going to need a lasso. Uh, I think I left some stuff over here, though. Um, and I think I did it again, guys. I think I lost my mining pick again. I don't know where they're going. That or it either broke. I don't really know. Uh, I checked over at the, um, at the village. It wasn't there. So, oh yeah, here's our minecart. Sweet. Let's grab some cobblestone while we're at it, too. Uh, okay. So, um, what I want to do is head over here, and what we're going to do is we're going to get cows in here. We're going to secure them in uh, via minecart, and it's going to be pretty easy to do, I think. Um, let me so get some cobblestone in here. So, obviously, we just want to do the two center spots right here, two and two. Let's go across and across. There we go. So what I'll do is I'll lasso them over here, and then probably just try to pull them into the cart. Um, and obviously, I want them to sit in the middle. So there, there, and there. We'll probably just bring it out to here. That'll be pretty easy to do. Something like that. And then we'll get some renamed name tags and uh, put the cows, name the cows so they don't ever despawn. That was another problem I kept having was cows were despawning. There we go. Yeah, I think that'll work just fine. Let me get, uh, let me lasso a cow and bring him over here. Hi right, guys, so I have the cow here. I'm trying to think about how I want to do this. Uh, I think the easiest way to, I don't want to push him. Maybe get rid of this. I don't know if I can... I think I need to break the uh, minecart to get that there. Come on. I don't want you to go around. Don't you fall. This is going to be harder than I thought. I say don't you fall and then I knock him down like an idiot. There's got to be an easier way to do this, you know? Oh, let's make some steps for him to get back up. Yeah. Come on, you fool. First off, I think I want to block this off. Because if I've learned from experience that I kill cows a lot, probably shouldn't have a gaping hole right next to where I'm trying to get the cow into the cart. There's gotta be an easier way to do this, you know? Cause he just like, does not wanna go in there. All right, I've got a better idea. All right, so here's my idea. I trapped him in there. And now I'm gonna place a cart down in there if I can. Um, I can't see the hitbox. Maybe if I just break a block out of the way. Okay. 
Oh, I just had it. Come on now. Oh, no, 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 no. Whew. That was close. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I almost had a heart attack. I wonder what his health is at. I, I guess you can't regen their health, but... Um, so we're just going to keep him in there like that. And then what I'll do is... Um, put fences. So now he definitely can't get out. Um... Actually, I need that there so the card doesn't move. Okay, let's get rid of this. And then I'll get rid of the holes, obviously. Um, that should work out pretty good, actually. I don't know if I want to keep that there and just put, like, some kind of pillar in. Uh, I'm going to get the other guy into the cart, and I'll be back. Hey, right, guys. So, I have um, two name tags and 14 XP, so we should have enough XP to uh, rename these. Oh, it's only five. Nice. Test subject... Number one. <clears throat> Test subject number one. And let's go here. I honestly thought it was seven for some reason. Subject number two. Okay, so we have test subject number one and test subject number two. I've got a bunch of quartz and some other dyes, uh, some hardened clay as well. Um I want to work on a little bit of interior design while we're here because this place looks like a dump. Alright, so with that being said, test subject number one, test subject number two. Nice! Alright, uh, one thing I did forget was wheat. Uh, I actually want to try to breed these guys. There's some. Let's see, I know I had some around here. Uh, that's one thing we have to work on today is wheat. Um, okay, so... Where's the baby? Did he fall? Oh, he's right there. I guess one way we could do this is... Uh, that's the one thing I was kind of afraid of, to be honest with you. Uh, let's see if we have any extra wheat. We have plenty. And we'll grab this while we're here as well. Gotta be able to slep. We gotta slep, guys. Uh, there we go. So I guess my game plan when I'm breeding would be this right here. Just like that. And, uh... Let's try... There we go. Awesome. Alright, so now that's what we'll do to... I'll just hold it. So the one thing that I kind of really want to work on right now is the wheat system. Uh, let's sleep. Come on now. There we go. And, um, so we need some seeds as well. But for the most part, this shouldn't be too bad. Uh, I was considering doing, like, an automatic thing. But I don't think I want to do it like that anymore. Um, so if you look at cows, they have, uh, gray blotches everywhere, you know? Like these cows do. I was thinking about doing that for the room. But, uh, I definitely want to put some wheat in first. What was this for? This was where the items are going to come up. Okay. Uh, so we have plenty of room over here then. Um, man, I just like, I was just like, oh, do I need anything at all for this? Holy crap. Where did I put everything at? Jesus. Pay attention, Jevin, man. All right. So I want the wheat to be over here. And, um, what I'll probably do is put a piston or a dispenser back there and I'll have the wheat sit right here. Like all the seeds. And so let's get this out of the way. Now, I was thinking about doing it to where we had dispensers all along this row. Um, how, I forget how to make dispensers. Isn't it? Isn't it like bows for dispensers? It's got to be a full bow, probably, though. Uh, do we have any dirt on us? No. I am just like, I was like, hey, you want me to forget everything that I absolutely need? Sure, go for it. So I'd like this process to be, you know, as automated as possible. 
So what we'll do is we'll put little traps of water here, little traps of water there. I don't have any buckets with me. Thinking about putting dispensers back there. Um, I think that'd be pretty cool. And then uh, we'll have blocks here. And so what we can do is like we'll have two buttons up here. We'll have one button like here and one button there. This button will uh, dis plant the seeds and the next one will harvest the seeds. I want to work on this a little bit off camera because like I forgot everything that I needed. <laughs> so I'll be back in a minute. All right, guys, I am actually going to have to go ahead and end the video. Um, I'm just out of time to record. That's all. I was just looking to see what we had. Uh, I grinded out about 21 levels. Next episode, we'll do an enchantment. Uh, I was trying to kill spiders during the nighttime, but I, because I have no string. Uh, this is what I was able to do with the dispensers. I need to find a way to stop um, the water. What I think I'm probably going to do is uh, put like hoppers down, put a hopper down somewhere uh, so I can collect all this stuff. And so it's going to be easy to do. I just have to get the material for it first. Uh, so guys, don't remember the Jev don't forget, don't remember the don't, don't forget the Jevenator challenge is 1777 likes and 500 comments. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and the world download for uh, the latest snapshot. Hope you guys have a great day. This is iJevin. Peace out.